sitting there eating it, hang out staring at sandwich. you. Yeah, it wasn't like we were close to a store either. <laughs> we were just having to sit there and watch it eat our lunch. <laughs> Speaking of uh, animals breaking into to food, I don't know why I feel like I've brought this up on, on the watch before, but maybe I have, maybe I haven't. I think the signs at Yosemite on the trash cans are really funny. <laughs> I, I don't know what you're they, uh, I don't remember the exact wording, but it's something about like the it's something about the locking mechanism, and it's like the overlap between a a dumb this human so and trippy. a smart bear is like is concerningly <laughs> large. It's like the National Park um, Instagram uh, story that they put up. Have you seen any of those? No. They're hilarious. So good. They actually have so somebody is doing a great job in their like yeah. social media department because it's those are really funny. They're very similar to they're very to like the dry humor describing. meme. Meme material. It's like if a bear is coming, run. Or Meme something. material. Oh, speaking of be faster than your friends. Or bears something. and national park service. Have you guys ever heard of um, Fat yes. Bear Week? Yes, yes, and it's amazing. We make what brackets every single yes, year. My friend Molly. Is it called Fat Bear Week? Fat Bear Week. Yeah. yeah what, is it, what is that? So it's every year the bears of I can't pronounce the national park name. Of Ket Ketamandu National. I can't remember it, but. They um, take pictures of the bears before they put on weight for their winter uh, um, hibernation and after, and you vote on huge. which bear is the fattest of the year. And they're they're all bear. It's like bear number two six four, bear number one four two. Some of them have names. Some have names, and they are giant yeah. bears. And you guys are making like, and I would got made fun of for watching marbles. What? <laughs> We're watching Marvel. People are like going to have a bracket with bears and how. Uh, how okay, how, but the how bears, there's like whole biography, like yeah. little bio biographies. Yeah, one of them ate 67 salmon in one sitting, Michael. Michael. That, that's a massacre. That, that tracks. <laughs> 60, can you eat Biographies. My marbles have biographies. <laughs> you make up stories. <laughs> no, they do. They, 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 they already have They whisper them to you. The speaker had a hard past life. No, it, it, the race. It's like they have their like their stats and stuff. It's, it's already there. Oh, we have we have somebody in the chat actually promoting the bear that they want to win. Which one is oh, it? Oh, really? eight two, oh eight six. Uh, it name? says Otis. <laughs> Otis. 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 Yes. I love Otis. <laughs> Actually, wait, where, where, where I think I was in Antarctica here. for this, and the bracket was up on the wall in Antarctica. Yeah. I'm what is the, I, I'm sorry, I totally mispronounced the, let me see if I can find the actual name of the park, because I want to give them some credit. This is so weird. <laughs> what? Oh, no, nothing. Okay. <laughs> Maybe someone will type it in the chat faster than I can find it. No, you got this. I don't know why I'm using Instagram. I could yeah, just this Google. is when we couldn't we couldn't look it up ourselves because of the Wi-Fi issues. Oh, so they yeah. printed out the biographies. They printed Cat, out that's awesome. brackets. That's awesome. Yep. It's just insane. Cat my National Lot Park uh, takes place on September yeah. 29th and 30th. Get ready, guys. Make Where's your that bracket located? soon. Can't um, even. That is in. I feel like I'm losing functions. <sighs> maybe, oh maybe my it needs goodness. Coffee. Bear 747. Oh yeah. They called him like the jumbo jet bear or something. I remember Ooh. this. I think I picked Incredible. him to win. 480 Otis. Sometimes they have cubs in there, which I don't think is totally fair. Why? Because cubs can't get as fat as um, Otis. Yeah, Katmai National Park, well, 260 uh, miles like southwest of Anchorage. Thing. Anchorage? Oh, it's Anchorage, in Alaska. Anchorage, 260 miles. It's in Alaska, yeah. Maybe they're in a different uh, bracket. Fat Bear Week voting open October 5th through 11th over my birthday. Oh, yeah, we got a lot of um, people in the chat saying cat mine. Thanks, guys. Are there, are there any scandals? Yeah, well, some, some of the bears were robbed, like, very much of the title, in my opinion. It's like oh, I, yeah, I, they consider were huge. That, I consider that a scandal. Like there was one that I think that actually there was a voting fraud. No, there was in fact a voting fraud. They had to like recount last year. Oh, really? oh my god! If you all could just see how earnest Jane's that. face is, she's like, this, yeah, this we take it seriously. In House upsetting. Otis, just hilarious. House of Otis. <laughs> oh man. I actually think 747 was my pick last year. So that's like a Sweet 16 bracket. It kind of looks like basketball bracket. Yeah, it is. That's it's awesome. exactly like that. That's funny. Oh, 25, 85. Okay, that's enough. That's enough on Fat Bear Week. We're almost to the bottom. Almost. Wow. What a good blue water, everybody. Yeah. Hey, we're not yeah, done yet. Cool. Zoomed fun. in on gelatinous zooplankton and learned a lot about 
a lot of stuff that doesn't matter that much, but that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> huh. We we have collectively Science. helped our but you know trivial what? It was team game. building. We bonded. And team with team this building. bonding, we will execute a better watch. A better one and a half hour watch. This was a long descent. Yes, we're going slower than normal. That's um, we had to stop yeah. by times. limits of pressure the machine at the moment. Sure. It's under pressure. It's just, it's oh, I like that song. Pressure. Do, 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 exactly, do. it's under pressure. Do, 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 do. Is it pushing down Not on enough you? pressure. <laughs> <laughs> That's perfect. <laughs> All right, bets. What are we gonna come right. down on? What? Her what? Her what, what what's pins. the substrate gonna be? Oh, um, sand. Sand. Uh, Actually, I, I don't know. It's a bit of a gravel sort of hill. Gravel. Uh, I'm gonna say rubble fields. Little gravelly bits. Okay. A whale. I'm hole. saying bigger than gravel. Oh. <laughs> 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 I says will buy your drink if that's the case. <laughs> That'd be so fun. No, no reciprocation needed. That would actually be kind of cool. And then, It'd be like, amazing. We have to, we have to leave. <laughs> oh, man. I, 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 my favorite, like, little clip is when uh, the one where the whale swims underneath Herc. Yeah, that's very cool. Yeah, oh, that's man. a good one. I wish I was there. I mean, yeah, yeah, and it, it, I think they were talking just right before someone had asked a question like, do you ever see whales? And they're like, no, yeah, unfortunately, no. never. <laughs> then it's like, whoa. <laughs> that's very rare. I've only ever heard of something I, like that happening one other time. Was that person who asked that question like a manifester or something? I guess so. Was it a whale? Um, Our other SCF, Brittany, is obsessed with whales. She said if she saw really? a whale on watch, she would, I think she said something Cry? like, Turn into is she a bubble of sparkles or something <laughs> like. Is she on the Dumbo Octopus watch? Because yeah, I think because she was. We should definitely put something. Say that we saw something on the whale watch. Yeah. It felt very mean. <laughs> that they got all the Dumbo Octopus. That they got all the Dumbo Octopus. All right. Fifty meters to Ooh. bottom. What's that? Crustacean. What? It's like a sea it spider. It, it does look kind of like a squat lobster. No, it looks like a sea <laughs> spider. <laughs> Weird but thing. it doesn't have enough legs. It has. Uh, yeah, it only has six. Well, it looks like it has like two. Oh, the smaller things. ones. Yeah. We'll get um, Paolo to identify it tomorrow. What a weird animal. All right, continuing on. Got to go. Sorry. Just Approximately uh, cool. 40 meters to bottom. Do you want to do pictures today? Yeah. She said, Brittany said, I would evaporate into bubbles and sparkles if she saw a whale. <laughs> evaporate into that's bubbles. Con that's concerning. Yeah, I don't know. What would, what would Defying we do? the laws of physics. What would we do if that happened? I don't know. Ring the fire alarm. All right, switching uh, over to manual descent. Oh, this is nice. Yes, I please. find middle of the night conversations more interesting than the daytime ones. Um, you oh. can, yeah, I just saw, you can see the ground there, so you can stop. You said that, Ashley, or the commenter said that? Um, it was in the chat. Oh. <gasps> oh. oh. I see large okay. rocks. Oh. Yeah, it looks kind of slabby with sand over it. Can kind we zoom out, please? Flowy. Yeah, thank you. Hold on a sec. We zoom in a little bit, please. That's good. Keep that there. Thank you. Sure. Okie dokie. Which uh, w which way are we gonna start moving to? Like which I direction? I know. Just a reminder that we have to do a yeah 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 yeah, yeah 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 yeah. I'm just trying to get press. Yes, yes. Thank you. Ripples, maybe? Some current action? Want to zoom in on that? Why not? If we're waiting for gauge checks or something? 
So fish biologists are really hoping to see a good zoom on the head and the, the pectoral fins on the underside when possible. We obviously can't get it to spin around, but. All right. Cool. Ready to keep heading back to the bottom? Okay, can we zoom out, please? Yeah, let's uh, white balance the. Uh, yes, thank you. Camera. A rot. Oh, little jellyfish. Mm. Look at the little guy. <laughs> Squirrel. Okay. Squishy. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Uh, yeah. uh. Well, good thing we don't have a jelly count. <laughs> you sounded so excited. This is definitely a more interesting um, landing spot than we've had. Not more interesting, but different, anyway. It's unique, for sure. Yeah. We didn't go for, like, a trough. We're kind of just landing part way down. Right here. Oh, I, thought, I thought my yeah. cursor was going to go up. Um, can you move back instead? Sorry? Can you move back instead of forward? Um, or at least just straight down. There just wasn't a good spot to, to sit gotcha, down. Gotcha, gotcha. Didn't move forward. I blah, blah, excuse me. I didn't move forward very much. Is that the iris playing it? Uh. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Are you, uh, is it steady? Yeah, I think so. If it doesn't... Uh, you want to get the arm? Or do you want to get it? No, you're going to have to get it. Okay. Can you, unless uh, you don't want, unless you really I don't, don't mind want it. to. I don't mind it. Because it's not going to stay like this. Um, I'm just going to have to hold it. That's fine. Um, and I'm just going to have to uh, keep you in, in Atlanta and then um, make sure you're racked all the way in, I guess. to enable. Okay, cool. Uh, give me, let me know when you're ready. I'm ready. You go ahead. I'm going to enable the craft arm. All right, enable the valve. Here we go. Go ahead. Are you able to focus on that or no? No, you have to. Can you I can move more. Oh, okay, good. You got it. Can you be closer? Is, is it possible? It, you want it closer? Yeah, it's possible. Uh, please. Well, hold on. Give me a second. I think that's 
Okay. As far as that position goes, that's as good okay, as you okay, get. Okay. If you can hold it there, um, I can rack the camera out to get it closer. You just change the bubble cam so we can see it, and then I'm comfortable doing that. Yeah. Do you need it closer, Panos? If possible, yes, because it's uh, a little bit green gray from the. Yep. Yeah. Oh, perfect. So I'm gonna do a black balance first, so it's gonna go dark. Copy. Okay, well, white balance. Okay, give me one moment. I'm ready. Thanks so much. You got it? Yeah, yeah, thank you. What the heck? What Careful, happened? there's um. Up. Apparently. Uh, the porch. Yeah. Oh, you might have dropped a weight, actually. I, th I guess I dropped something. Oh, no, no, no. That was the front one, right? You just un un untied it. You didn't. You I didn't. You I didn't pull it. You didn't pull it. You want to get it out? Um, do you want me to? Uh, you can you or no? Yes. Yeah. If you're. Yep. Yeah, absolutely. Because I just. I'm jumbled and I don't know what I did. I mean, I could try, but I don't want to waste okay. time. It's all right. <coughs> If you need me to move, zoom in or anything, let me know. Getting all the buttons mixed up. There we go. Okay, so it wasn't me. Um, yeah, that's fine. It's on the porch. It's not going to interfere with us. So. And we got the washer. So. <laughs> we got the washers. It's not going to float. So. That was weird, cause like, okay. did it like did it do something weird for you too? Um, or maybe I just grabbed it. It weird. was just, uh, I think it was caught. That's all. Okay. It was just a little bit caught. Cause like I was moving um, things and it went opposite a couple times. All right, let me get the let me get these numbers real quick. Whoa, look at our res. Oh wait, never mind. No, no, no. <laughs> I thought that, I, th I thought that was the bottom. I thought that was like the bottom bottom. <laughs> you know what I mean? Okay. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, I mean, we're pretty much at waypoint one, um, so we can start heading upslope toward waypoint two. We're going to be moving the ship west, so if Hercules wants to get west of Atalanta, we can start stepping in that direction. And I would love to keep us going at continuous ship moves. We can start with point two knots um, and just, yeah, would be great to stay a little ahead so we can buy time for anything that's cool. But um, please do let us know if you're about to get tugged um, or something and we'll 
we'll move on rather than <clears throat> automatically holding um, ship or, pro or not putting in a move. Because we can and will get distracted and stay there. <laughs> no, that's okay. Oh my god. And also just like pacing it. We don't have to be way out ahead um, waiting on the ship either. Ferraid? Uh, Ferraid, yeah. Aspidoscopulia sponge. All I can think about is how big that one we saw yesterday was. Yeah, that was the one that we were trying to say three times fast, too. Mm-hmm. Aspidoscopulia. Aspidoscopulia. Okay, Oh, you ready for a move. Okay. Mm -hmm. Bridge nav. Hey, can we have three zero meters west, please? Thank you. I have an awesome comment in the, in the chat if it's an okay time to read it. Um, yeah. It was saying, I was playing your 2022 highlights on my classroom sm Ooh. smart board, mm. which makes me so happy as a teacher, during nice. open house and pointing out the girls and to the girls in my class, all the female voices on board the Nautilus. Good. So Boop thank you so much so for doing that. Yeah, that's awesome. All right, some dead sponge stocks already. Maybe there's some cool living sponges somewhere. Besides the 0 0.2, the please. Thank you. All right, would you say they're at 50% these comps? Uh, I would say so. That's a steep slope. Yeah, it looks like this whole area is going to be relatively steep. Mm -hmm. Until we get another 400 meters. Yeah, that bit might be, might be a good spot to hand over. No, I'm just kidding. Oh, look, that's a big dead Aspidoscopulia. Yeah, on the left. Just interesting. That one looks a little fresher. Still got its shape. <clears throat> yeah, there was a there was a darker one that looked almost a little encrusted further down. Yeah, there there, there's the darker one on the bottom. Anything cool on the left? Oh yeah, it looks cool in Atalanta to see the rocky feature run and that sponge we just passed. That's a cool nice. shot. Yeah, that's really pretty. You're welcome. It's like we're surrounded by rock, huh? What do you want? Yeah, that's one thing I noticed when oh, you're going yeah, through these images and we're writing the dive no, reports is, um, I think I'll there's a sea cucumber on the left, by the way, know. is- um, Strain my neck. You'll look at the picture and you'll be like, oh, we were in a, such a sandy area, but it's like one tiny patch yeah. surrounded <laughs> by rocks on all sides. It was like when we were looking at the one sponge and then we right. looked. You're zoomed in and you're like, they're huge coral everywhere, but it's like two <laughs> tiny little things. Mm -hmm. And also, for instance, it's not the, sed the sediment is not that fine. It's quite a sandy patch. It's more, s more yeah, coarse. It's coarse. Yeah. yeah, foraminifera. Is shells. that good for sea pens? Have you noticed that it's some parts very green here? I think that's sponge spicules, maybe. Also, there is these lines. Um, yeah, I noticed there's like a little patterned almost. Yeah. I wonder if it's that um, boom breakage oh, pattern. Oh, wow, look how sandy that is. But heavy, you know, it's coarse. It's like not floofing up even as much as you'd expect. Mm. 
So I was concerned, I was talking with Steve, because maybe there is, maybe if you will find uh, sea pants, maybe it's fine in um, the deeper layers and you have a little bit more sand at the top, you know. Mm. So if you find uh, uh, more, um, some communities in the, in the sub sediment, it would be nice to get a push core. Okay. Looks like there's another sponge up ahead of us. Do you think here this patch would be sponge? I like maybe spicules. We could zoom on that where the lasers are now if we have a if yes, we're waiting. Just to might as well confirm what we're looking at. I don't know. Oh no, it's altered rock. The rock is is uh, oxidized somehow. Is in the triclops looks so green. Yeah, right. No, I don't know if that's like volcanic plastic or something. Mm. It looks though like when we pick up a rock and it looks like yeah. sad on one side. Thank you. Can we get the uh, iris down a little on the? Uh at Atlanta, just a tad. Nice. A little bit, like back, uh, back to where it was a little. In between what it was and what it is. Yeah, right there. Hopefully it doesn't flicker. I wanna see that spill. Thank you. Yeah, I think that's good. There it is. Yeah. That looks so this is cool. It looks a lot like the one we collected the other Thank day, you. I think. I was going to say the same thing. It looks a lot like it, actually. And sure. I didn't believe it at first when, when or not didn't believe it, but I, I was like, huh, I don't think I've noticed that before when Steve said, oh, I think it's just a big Espidoscopulia, which is the one we just saw, um, and that it looks the same from the back, because we didn't have pictures of that one from the back, but this one... We did Are actually. We got them. Oh, really? We got them after. Oh. So actually, I should have made note of that. I think because we sampled it, then we got a squat lobster in the same spot, and then we moved oh, around back. Oh, got it. Okay. We yeah, but there you can clearly see really beautiful images of oh, that. Oh, what is that? <laughs> but it looks like it has such weird protrusions. Sea rabbit or something. <laughs> <laughs> it's like it's not a pig. Protrusions. Maybe a, a rabbit. A big sea pig, but purple. I feel like they're usually. Translucent, but that's fine. Yeah. Thank yeah. you. Okay. And we have a cinema camera at the satellite feed three. And that's for the triclops camera. Yes. Thank you. The clops. Is it okay to call it the triclops? That's yeah. the only one yeah. now. It's a yeah. It would be a cyclops. The triclops. <laughs> it's the cyclops. Yeah. Cinema cam. That's oh wow! Cool, These yeah. he's are pretty bad. The tether almost went over Atlanta. Really? Yeah. The Atlanta view is so nice. Looks yeah. like we see the the ROV looking this little dot. This <laughs> is mm -hmm. so. I've never seen a sea cucumber with such a big cape. It's a superhero. It's <laughs> we when we get closer. I would love to get like a an sample? even better zoom of that. No, oh. just look at it more closely because it's I'm I've not seen anything like that one before. This one wanted to get in on our superpower conversation. Yeah, exactly. exactly. <laughs> it does look like it has bunny ears, though. Right? I tried to catch it. So did you say this is a sea pig or a sea cucumber? Well, I don't know. I mean, it's some kind of polytherian, but I don't know what kind. The sea pigs are the ones that have that kind of... Um, 
like the modified two feet that look more like that those like cape features but i haven't seen one that's so long and it doesn't have the like sea piggy uh modified two feet feet in the front wow, bridge that's that. interesting wow three zero west please wow, it certainly it. is a Thank sea you. cucumber Thank of course and you can see what it ate for lunch dinner and breakfast it's like wrapping quite a bit oh my gosh it's i don't know if i trust this delta Oh, it almost looks like it has an this eye. This one, it's not no, it's Cyclopodes. Like, there's so much I think slack it's coming up. Cyclopodes or Cyclopodes. For like a Delta Cyclopodes semantics. So you were <laughs> saying you could see what <laughs> it eats. Diction. What what do they eat? They uh, are just pretty far feeding on me. the feeding on the sediment. So well, they're ingesting the sediment and then taking out of it what they can, whatever it is that's rained down from higher up. Yeah. Um, so you're seeing, if you see those little, like, kind of brownie bits, there's phytodetritus that comes down from higher up in the water column, and they filter through all of that and, and eat what they can. Reminds me of our bunny that we have at home. <laughs> Reminds me of a, a bed skirt coming down off the mattress. <laughs> oh, that's interesting. <laughs> <laughs> Around the all sides. Right. All right, do we want to slip yeah. it or? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, put me in. I want him a nip. I got some good photos. We're good. That's why we slurp. We we did used to slurp a lot, quite yeah, a few yeah, sea yeah, cucumbers, yeah. but I I want to say old yeah. Herc slurp diameter was a little bigger. Yeah, but they're sp like they're like compressible. To a certain point. Can we turn off the lasers real quick, actually, for a picture? Oh. And, yeah. then, and then I didn't hear a please, so I'm just, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <Stop>. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm just kidding. But seriously. I just need to steady for one second. Yeah. Whoa, whoa. There, yeah. All right, that's great. Thank you. This is going to be an interesting we dive with the pressure issues. Take a look at what else is around. That's okay. James, are you just talking to Michael, or was that for us? Sorry, my uh, SPL thing was off. No, I was just uh, I was saying it's um, it's a little bit harder today. It's going to be you an interesting bear it with us. What All specifically right. is it? The same thruster pressure issue? That it's you a mentioned pressure earlier? issue. Yeah. Yeah. It uh, seems Can we get the lasers back on, please. Yet intermittently, intermittently frequent. No, it's been pr yeah, um. it's been pretty steady since we launched. Actually, that's why we got down slower than we should have. Right. Well, like well, I say, despite the fact that we were Gabby had it for like a solid two hours. But oh, then that's true. Flew, she didn't have yeah. anything, and then when you had it, you only had it a little bit. And then what? Yeah. So it does what it wants. Lynette, if it stays a little lack, lackluster, could we uh, bump up to point three on the next moves? Yeah, sure. Thank you. Oh, I'm a oh. Can we pan to the right a little? Yes, we can. I'm just curious, looking at that rocky ridge. Kind of cool bump. It's a cool feature to see these flows. And you can almost sure. kind of see here, like I, I want to say that that's also a product of how the how the flow occurred, those 2B ripples. It does look like flowing lava. Yeah. That's we have a shrimp for the not shrimp count. <laughs> yeah. <coughs> We can zoom on the shrimp. Yeah, absolutely. If you want, zoom, zoom, zoom. Whoa, too fast. Just kidding. Nice. Oh, it's like kicking for dear laugh. He's trying so hard. Is he? Looks like he's it's a interesting shape. Looks like he's carrying something. Yeah. It. Is it gravid? It is. That's what I, I said. don't know. It's, I'm kind of thinking something like that. I've. It, it does look the like I've not seen this before. Wouldn't know what it looked like, but it. 
certainly oh. has some kind of a bulb. It does look almost like. Does it look like small you saw egg super inside? Close. I was gonna say, it's Bridge an now. uneducated guess, but could it be that it is carrying babies or? Yeah, maybe. Uh, Five zero meters west, like. and can we increase speed to zero point three knots, We're please? We're really close to them. Thank you. We're seeing all kinds of interesting things. All right, yeah, zoom out. I guess we're already zoomed out. Yes, I am on. That is the cam. Yeah. You got too close to the vehicle there. In too tight. All right. Heading west. If a shrimp is pregnant, you'll be able to see egg clusters near its abdomen. So yeah, that sounds oh, about nice. right. That was cool. Hopefully you guys got a shot of that. I think so. Sorry, it was brief. No, that's fine. <sighs> if, Tried we're to get a out a, if we're out ahead and there isn't much to see, no reason to stay for a sec longer and look around. Is this still the craft arm on the on Herc? What? The ground fault? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, another one of those sponges. <laughs> Dead. What happened here? <laughs> Jane, are you Googling shrimp re recipes over there? Well, so I accidentally, I Googled, shrimp egg I sh I Googled egg. shrimp with egg bundle and a bunch of <laughs> and it's like all fried Asian, eggs with shrimp. All Asian, Asian like lunch specials. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> Do, are you spying on me? I am. I just saw food on your screen and I was like, what? <laughs> Looks like breakfast. Interesting. Hmm. What are you? What is this? What's this? I'll what zoom this? in there. Oh, polykey. Oh, it's a swimmer polykey, I think. Let's see if we can get him in the cinema cam. And uh, should be popping in now. Coming in soon. Polykey, meaning Whoa, ma too close. many, <laughs> many CT. Many keats. Many keats, many CT. Many of those bristly bits on their um Look podia. at these nodules. Yeah. Is that what these are? Uh, yeah. To the left? Debatable. It depends on who you talk to and what, what their definition of nodule is. That looks like another um, Xenophyophore there. Where are you looking? Um, south of the... South. Just that little <laughs> thing there. Oh, yeah. Could we look at that? Yep. Zoom in. Or it could just be a divot in the sand. You never know. Well, it looks like something. Sponge. Traumatic. Super hero pose. Or so it could be a clump of sand. <laughs> oh, Xenophile a bunch of sand. are so hard, though. Uh, they really do just kind of look like... It looks like, like a sand. bundle of sand on top of something that was there. Like that something wasn't yeah. there. Something please? left it behind. Thank you. Thanks so much. We have a good morning from my home state of Kentucky. Good morning, Kentucky. Good morning, Kentucky. Um, not much life, but it still looks pretty beautiful. And we're hoping to find some more as we go along. Zoom in there. Yeah. Oh. A sea pig? Another. Looks like it. Yeah, that one looks. Big that's a sea pig. Space. But another big, uh, big cape. All the sea pigs on the seamount are superheroes. 
Lila, you said that the sea pigs fly away too, right? They do yep. fly away. We yeah, actually and oftentimes they do that when we come up to them. But yeah, they haven't been doing that much. Um, oh, this one seems on to be up watch. on its tippy toes. Poke them with the arm. Yeah. Oh, oh. <gasps> take oh, flight. Oh, oh, and they oh, always oh, expel their poo oh. at the same time. <laughs> yeah. A flying sea pig. A flying sea pig. <laughs> oh, literally, literally scared it out of him. <laughs> yeah. <Let> him go. <laughs> That's amazing. That's yeah, so really those are so really gross. Cool. modified two feet that they <laughs> flap back and forth to <laughs> swim, which is a very impressive thing like to be to able see, to do. Like to see a regular run of the mill sea cucumber do that. This is so interesting. They do that. It's yeah, I've seen it. It's it's sea just cucumber? as it's just as creepy. <laughs> <laughs> well, that purple one that we were just looking at. Shrimp. They can expel all kinds of stuff. They can expel their sandy poo they can expel their guts out of their mouths they can um expel their cuvarian tubes tubules another like sticky mess for defense are you counting the shrimp that's beautiful oh shrimp. yeah we're kind of i think we're taking a hiatus on the shrimp count just for this dive at least we're just taking a break I'm keeping a like mental three. tally. Wow, that is beautiful. This is, is really translucent. This is yeah. a lyrical dance, actually. <laughs> <laughs> is this kind of what the, uh, the sea pig is doing an interpretive that dance? <laughs> Sorry, Jane, it's I didn't so mean to talk about this. What is it trying to tell us? Probably like get away uh, from it. <laughs> so this is, is a defense thing, but it may also, you know, be convenient when they've exhausted wherever they've been feeding and want to move on to whatever it's like fighting a current is like so bad right now. And part of the reason their ears are so translucent um, is because they have less collagen and it makes it easier for them to, yeah, take flight like this. Bridge now. Five zero meters west, please. Thank you. All right. Yeah, we can move. Move on. That was a pretty sea pig dance. Thank you, sea pig. Yay. Pretty high up. Yes. Yeah. We're up they five get meters. Really high. Wow. Up. What's your highlight style, Ashley? Was that highlight worthy to you? Oh yeah, I definitely oh, yeah. highlighted a uh, flying pig. <laughs> <laughs> do we need a rock I try not to down here? Too stupid. Oh, yeah, that's a rock. great <laughs> suggestion. Who said that just now? What was it? That was Lynette. me, Nav. Yeah, Lynette. What did Nav <laughs> say? I didn't hear it, I'm sorry. That just we should get a rock. That's oh, yeah. totally the truth. Um, yeah, would it be possible to get ahead and then Pick a rock sure. to pick up while Shrimp. the ship moves. You want me to get it? Some of these look loose enough. Jump, jump ahead a little bit. You want me to get it? Or do you the want to jump out? The sponge up? looks like in there. Um, I don't mind. Next. I haven't done that. Uh, <laughs> okay. Couple sponges, two stocks. That's cool. That I don't want to do like anything. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to, man, go no, for man, it. Would you like some flying? I'm just teasing. Not, not with this pressure. Looks issue. like a crinoid or something on the top. Yeah. Another one was. It's kind of interesting. We've seen only this sponge. Actually, I think we just passed a regadrilla. It might even be in really down camp. Just a small one, very light. You could probably get a, a little bit further ahead. Oh yeah, that's yeah a great I'm just picture. looking at this thing. Yeah, I know. In the cinema cam. Yeah, it's a great picture in the cinema cam. Really cool. Here, I'll be your teammate. We talked about how it kind of looks like um, oh, a spine. Definitely. Vertebrae? Yep. Like a rib cage. What kind of monster do you think it belongs to? This will be some nice picks. It's yeah. a high focus win, but then they move yeah, and yeah. They get out. Sorry. No, it's not your fault. There's also a crinoid, <laughs> on, a crinoid on the top of it. I got it. Uh, I okay. think I got the first, the first picture. Uh, 
Nice. Thank okay. you. Thanks so much. No problem. Okay. All right. Let's. Uh, or dead sponge. Or yeah. dead. Oh, big one. Yeah, big one. Partially dead. No. No, dead. Covered dead. in sand. <laughs> well. Okay. Looks so. like another one. On one of the boulders up ahead, though. Wow, that's wow. a big one. It is a big one. Wow. Whoa, it's huge. Is that a sponge? Yeah. Huge, yeah. Yeah. Same one we've been seeing. Just a really big one. It's an eel or and something. And then there are more. Well, look, if you... There's quite a bit of rocks right there. I was going to say, it looks like yeah, some nice rocks. Yeah, those are good rock spots. Yeah, if, I mean, that's far enough ahead. Fish. Hopefully we don't need to pick around too much. They look all pretty, pretty decent. Um, Amazing frame there. What bio box would you like it in? Uh, starboard. Okay. And more dead sponge. If we could look at that one there. And a swimmer right there. Oh yeah. What is wow? Oh it's the same, yeah, the swimmer party. Stay there. Uh, uh, I'll turn on the craft when you're ready. Sorry? I'll turn off the valve when you're ready. Okay, go for it. I'm going to switch over cell bus. Roger. Oh, actually, no. Actually, can you go back until I have yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. Thank you. So either that one There's one that. right in front of the cinema game. That looks perfect. Like right in the center of the cinema game. This oh. is the one you pointed at, right? Yep. Oh, okay. Yeah, that looks, that looks good. There's a sponge stock that wants to come with. If we could wait for the dust to settle quick and then get yeah. a good spin for Jane. Yeah. Spin with um, some pauses so that I can take photos without blur. Sure. Thank you. If we need to pick up and move on with it too, that's okay. We got uh, a not little yet. bit of time. Okay. Yeah. We got enough time. Data, what number is that? That will be 111. 111, thank you. Nice rock. Good size, good angles. A little altered, sorry <laughs> folks. Okay. Okay. Perfect, thank you. Looks like maybe a small associate okay. on the bottom. Okay. Uh, we can do any of the starboard bio boxes. Let's aim for, maybe we'll go back to front. Leave, sure. Leave easier things for the front later. Uh, let's go uh, bio box D, please. All right, let me know when you're ready to open it up. Um, I'd like to see it first. Yeah. Unless we're really fighting. All right, go ahead. A box, I'm sorry. Uh, D, please. D. D as in dead sponge. Grip lock. Make sure. There we go. Perfect. Thank you. Beautiful. Yeah, that was a fantastic collection, good, pilots. Good haul in that. Quick and fast. Good angular rocks. Quick and fast mean the same thing, actually. I got you a bubble. <laughs> Quick and well Thank done. You. Semantics. <laughs> you know. I, love it. I wouldn't have even noticed it if you hadn't pointed it out. <laughs> okay. Arms frozen. All right, yeah, let's get moving before we have to. Uh, yeah. Buy sponge stock. Fly by looks. Fly by looks. Fly by sponges. Oh, is that one? A couple but dead ones, eh? Yeah, so those are all 
Interesting. Dead or dying. The stock actually of that one, the lasers is over. Are over. Looks all right. Hmm. Um, so the brighter white ones are still yeah. alive. Yeah. Or some part of them is. We've had. Uh, there was a dead Walteria that we collected that actually still had some living, living bits. Bridge now. What would cause a sponge like that to die? Just five zero time. west, please. I don't know. That was asked last Thank time you. too. Yeah. I I don't know much about like what is the termination in their lifespan. If yeah. It's like because they can the regenerate the so well. The gradient in the shadow. Yeah. Maybe just lack of food or Looks something. Looks really cool. It does look really cool. <laughs> yeah, or or like they get too heavy and then fall over and are that no makes longer fun. anchored appropriately to the substrate. <gasps> is that a oh. sea pen? No, it's <gasps> a sponge. I think it's either Semperella. Can oh. But can we, we zoom, zoom in? Maybe yes, Semperella was what I was thinking of as opposed to Regadrella. Yeah, so Semperella sponge. Semperella. Can you zoom in the base, please? Yeah, there's another of the hydrids, right? Uh, it looks like too warm. Or oh, yeah, it does. What was it that we were seeing so much at the bases? Turn the iris down. Because yeah, we were you. seeing at the base of, uh, of the Regadrella or a lot of sponges on previous dives, we were seeing things, but I don't remember what it was. Uh, like some of them had like a lot of like just stuff growing around, and then some of them had a. Uh, but there was some polyp form something that was growing, seeming to grow. But it's nice how to see how they are attached. Turn the iris down yeah. a little bit. Um, Associate as yep. well. I had line on. I just going to try to get some of this perspective with the triclops. Can we zoom in? Do you want it closer? Or it is zoomed in, I guess. Then yes, it's full zoom. Forever yeah. and ever. Uh, that, that's perfect. Thank you so much. No problem. Come wide, please. Uh, don't work, don't, you know. Don't forget who to what? Don't, uh, don't be shy to ask us to turn off the lasers if you want to get the a lasers. view without the lasers. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks. Uh, I forget, I'll forget about that often. I feel like I tune them out. Yeah, so do I. Okay. Wow, the Atalanta cam, you can really see those sponges coming. I know. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah. I'm always, I'm waiting. I'm always waiting for them. I'm like, I want to see that one. Have you been noticing um, current on the vehicle? No, not, not really. a lot of current. Okay. A good telltale sign is like if you can see the first couple floats in Atlanta, uh -huh. you can judge the f you know right. which way the cable's going um, relative to the vehicle. Yeah. Right now we get right now there's very little than anything. Just interesting because we're seeing like some kind of ripply bits in the sand. Which you don't always see, but yeah, no current. No, there right might, now. you know, oh. at some point in yeah, time there variable. might be current, but right now What's I don't this? feel it. Uh, it's like the like Venus flytrap. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, I was so excited for you, thinking it might be one of your. No, I'm uh, keeping an eye on. Like, I guess I need, I guess I need to have the uh, triclops claim a little bit closer somehow, because I can't see the same thing that you do. That's very cool. That's really good. You can, so try to get you can zoom in, Panos. On a you dead sponge stock, the Venus flytrap anemones aren't actually this tall themselves. They take advantage of dead sponges or corals and uh, and grow on top of them. Well, so I'm going to sit down and we'll get a good view. Do you know if they can move? Like if this sponge stock they collapses, can, like, can they it? go find another one? <gasps> oh. 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 Fantastic shot of that. <laughs> Lynette, I think it hurt you. <laughs> I've never actually seen them uh, yeah, close like that. That was cool. See if we can get on the other side and then I don't maybe think it'll they open can up. Move, move Lynette if if they if I this don't think one move up, this sponge stock finally uh, falls. Oh, you should have enough time. I don't Little know that they can move to another one. They're pretty okay. wrapped around this one. Oh yeah, we've got tether. You're really close actually. Yeah. That was awesome. That was pretty cool. <laughs> Hopefully. It was really cool in that cinema cam. Yeah. Yeah. Did you get a picture of that? I did, but oh, I'm nice. take so many yeah, because okay. one 
you'll be in focus, uh, hopefully. So that was oh. a good example of it being a supply trial thing. If you can, would be able to see in the front of it. Yeah, we're going to yeah. try to get around. Yeah. Ah, perfect, thank you. I'm afraid I didn't quite get a good picture before it retracted. Huh. Looks like the peach emoji. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> or just a peach, I guess. Doesn't have to be the emoji. <laughs> <laughs> not a peach, just the emoji. Yeah. It looks like no, if not uh, the emoji, just the peach. <laughs> if it, uh, if a sponge was a puppet. Yeah. Oh, look at the the side oh angles gosh, too. It's so cool. Oh, super cool. Whoa. Here I got this. So when we're moving like that, if you click on the cinema cam still cap, what does that look like, Jane? Does it look um, focused? The I saw that from focus. the data log, uh, like you can see in Z log the pictures that we take. Yeah, it looks good. Yeah. Yeah, it does. Wow, there's a sponge in the background of one of these pictures. That's pretty right. cool. Yeah, there's a big, um, big umbrella I think right, right in front of us. Wow. Oh. You're going to need to start moving. Mouth. Yeah, I can feel it already. As we're I can give you an extra we're back extra around. Bit. Okay. All right. Okay, Bye. perfect. Thank you so much. That was really awesome. Very cool. <sighs> oh, yay, nice. yay. Reminds me of... um. I mean, I guess it's named Venus Flytrap for a reason, but Audrey from The Little Shop of Horrors. Actually, I haven't seen that. It is worth a watch, for sure. Oh, Ooh. that's... Huh. Hello. Bridge now. Oh, it's a little one. Five zero west, please. Yeah. Thank you. In my mind, I'm saying C pin, C pin, C uh, pin. Thank you. I'm. <laughs> let's, let's do. I know uh, there's enough there. <laughs> you think maybe? Yeah, but it, I think it's quite. This I course. think it's probably not here. very yeah. deep, and, and also coarse. Yeah. Could we look at the rock on the right? Rock on the right, you Ooh. say? Ah. <laughs> 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 Whenever we're looking in the cinema cam, it's like, ah. <laughs> oh, wow. That one? Uh, I was looking in Atalanta. At what's ahead on the right there? Yeah. Uh, yeah, you may be uh, looking down a bit. It's interesting to see the boat, uh, how big boats has uh, several sponges. Yeah, the big boulders are uh, yeah, have sponges on boulders, them. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Yeah. And it is all the dance one thank yeah, as well. Oh, is there a sea star on that one? Oh, yes. A couple of dead sponges. Could we pirouette to that sea star? Yeah, well, can we zoom in, Pals? Looks like a brazingid with its velcro-y arms covered in those pedicillaria uh, jaw-like structures that they can snap closed. Jaw-like, really? Yeah, so every single one of those spines has, they look almost like, uh, like a tiny bird beak or something that they can snap closed. I would like to see that. Yeah, I mean, they're really, really small. Um, and then they use their two feet to transport the food from wherever it's been snapped down to their mouths. On other sea stars, they also have those structures, but not as they're not as densely covered at all as the Brazingids are. And other sea stars use those pedicillaria 
to keep their um, their outside free from kind of felling or other things growing on it. Before they decide the ophiroids, that's good. Thank you. They you can come wide. The arms yeah. be much more flexible. Yeah, yeah. They um, these also have interesting ossicles inside that allow them because they feed with their with their arms way extended up. Usually that one didn't really have it out, but usually their arms are, are flipped facing straight up. And so the ossicles, which are the calcium carbonate hard parts oh, inside of sea stars. I think it's dead swim trait. Are um, kind Sorry, of like vertebrae almost so that they can do that, so that they can hyperflex their Can you zoom in, Panos? Yeah, it looks dead, eh? Dead. Is it dead. Dead. Yeah, Something living underneath there? Shrimp! Oh, yeah. Nope. Who knows what's inside, though? Yeah, that was one thing that Paolo was bringing up, that sometimes collecting the dead things leaves you with a lot of really interesting uh, associates. There is a shrimp, you're right. There is a shrimp. Sponges provide structure even when they're dead. Get off my lawn. <laughs> get <laughs> get off my lawn. You darn kids. I've lived in this sponge for all my whole life. <laughs> Come wide, please. If it were a squat lobster, would it be squatting in the sponge? Oh, yes. <laughs> that was a good one. We're tired. <laughs> for those watching, we're really oh, tired. Something <laughs> here. 3.11 a.m. Uh -huh. So oh, yeah. oh yeah, what is that? Yeah. That's cool. That. I, saw, I see it, I see it. Nice eyes, good job. Yeah, sea very spider? nice eyes. I hope so, I friggin' love sea spiders. You zoom in, fellas? Yeah, it is, it's a picnogonid. Wow. Is that a sea spider you said? Yes, it is. And so the long thing sticking out is it's proboscis, and they use that to wow, like this is suck awesome. the nutrients the food out of their prey amazing so they're not um not arachnids they're not in the same group as spiders but they are kind of in they're closely related within the arthropods within the larger group that interesting um you gave it a storm to weather <laughs> contain spiders and sea spiders what are you talking about so cool <laughs> Can we come wide, please? One, two, three, and sea four, stars are one of the animals in the Antarctic and in the deep sea in places where there's cold water. Or sorry, not sea stars, yeah, sea spiders. That um, they often exhibit gigantism. They can get really, really big. Um, Wouldn't yeah. want to run into so one when of I was scuba diving in Antarctica, I saw a lot of really big sea spiders. They're super cool. How big was the one it's you terrifying. saw in Antarctica? Um, uh, probably the biggest one, maybe like if I put two of my hands next to each other, wow. like that wide. We we brought, so there was a touch tank at McMurdo because not everyone obviously gets to dive, but people think the animals are cool, so we would bring some of them back to the, the big, lab. There's a huge sponge to your left. And keep them in the water, and when we brought back some sea spiders, and one of them was I affectionately can see it. named it's just coming Bernard. Into view. Aww, we Bernard. tried very hard to get Bernard to wear a 3D printed oh. cowboy oh. hat. Sorry, I was looking That's at the sponge okay. up ahead of us. Uh, what are you looking at? There is few of these. You see the in the triclops? Oh, like teeny tiny white. Yeah. Yeah. But there is several. Can we zoom I in, Panos? Oh yeah, like here, just right in the sand in the middle. Some to the left as well. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, where there's no dust. Maybe they are xenophyophores. Yeah, it can be. Hold on a second. There's one like right right down there too. Ah. But with the cyclops you can see like there is so many. Yeah, there's like a bunch in the in That the I think is exactly what it looked like when we saw the Xenophia four before. Yeah. 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 I mean on the other um, dive yesterday. Was it yesterday? <laughs> Could we cool. take a look at one of the <laughs> other ones too? Can you zoom out? Uh, or was it this morning? I think it was yesterday. Can you zoom in? Yeah, right right in the middle there is one. Have we ever collected sea spiders, the question in the chat? Ooh. Um, 
I've never been on a on a cruise where we've collected a sea spider, but uh, probably. You're gonna want to zoom ahead. Yeah, we can yeah, move on. We need some time. Yeah, Thank we're getting so there. Thank you. Nice zoom eyes. out, please. Yeah, I don't know how you saw that. Yeah, we'll it. just do a flyby of this sponge because we don't have time to stop. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, all good. Yeah, sure. Um, I do like to have the Herc screen somewhere. Yeah, sure. Oh, um, it would be Montop Tri. Oh, look at this one. That one has scoliosis. <laughs> uh, yes, it does. <laughs> Need a brace. We don't have much time here. We're That's just okay. Gonna There's a thing on it. That's a cool view of it, oh. though. There's like a little tiny, cuppy. Yeah, a tiny thing. little whitey thing. There's a little white thing on one of its bridges. Nice flyby. Get it in the cinema cam. <laughs> I'm trying to focus. Yeah. yeah. Oh, beautiful. I'm sorry. It looks like the light as well changed. Change. Yeah, yeah. Oh, there's another sea there's pig. There's another sea the pig, yeah. That's okay. We see you, sea pig. <laughs> you're lucky that we're falling behind. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're not going to have to fly away and poop at us. Wow, it's really soft sediment around here. Yeah, there is, right? Someone passed. And here we can see parts of what looks like uh, bioturbation. Bridge now. Mm -hmm. Five zero west, please. Thank you. I'm not sure what that. Oh, it's fine the way it is. Can I zoom in, Paros? Uh, two anemone is sedentary. Yeah. That's a big one. You're seeing a lot of smaller one of ones. The on scientist previous ashore asked for a collection. I, um, guess, I think it was Tina, uh, maybe? Of of one of the sedentary. These, the two yeah, anemones? We need to check the. Yeah, we can look back. This one, I think, is too big to do the like push core type thing that we had thought. I don't think a push core would work with this instead yeah, of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We could scoop it, and then there's the scoop. Gone. We could suction it and put it in the poor bio box. Did that work? I think that one looks pretty big. No, I think it if would... Mm. If we see it, if we see a smaller one. Okay. All right, and zoom out. And also, we can cool. check if there is more information of... Um, yeah. Yeah. Looks like there's more of those little, what'd you call them? Those little white things. The xenophyophores? Just above the lasers now, there's two of them. Mm. And which yeah. Camera? yeah, there's a bigger one off to the left. And the bigger one off to the left, yeah. It would be cool to sample one, but I don't know how we would do that because we can't really core it and uh, they are really crumbly. It'll just yeah. break, so. <sighs> So we'll I mean, we could try a core, but I, I, I'm i not hopeful. No, I'm not either. Can zoom in, Panos? Yeah, quick zoom. Yeah, very cool. Is this a coral or a sponge? Um, no. This is a... No, it's a foram. Yeah. A hmm. uh, and... Previously thought to be sponges, but not. 
Um, and they're single-celled organ organisms that build the structure you're seeing out of the surrounding sediment. I really don't know much about them, but they're pretty fascinating. It's really interesting, yeah. There is a postdoc in NOC that is taxonomy. Can we come wide, please, Panos? Where? In NOC, in the uh, south. Something a little bigger oh, up cool. ahead. Let's go take a look at that. Leila, you were talking about diving in Antarctica. Did you have to have any specific certifications for that? Oh, yeah. Um, uh, so I was uh, diving on the at the research station and. So it was on a research grant, funded by a research grant, and uh, you had to be a scientific diver because it was scientific tasks that we were conducting underwater. Um, so I had I, science diving certification, but we also dive in dry suits. Um, oh yeah. The water is minus two degrees Celsius. It's even colder than freezing because it's salty and it can be even colder than freezing. Um, and the air above us was, you know, when I first wow. arrived there, the wind chill was like minus 60 degrees. Oh my gosh. So, uh, I learned there that minus 40, or I felt there that minus 40 Fahrenheit and minus 40 Celsius are, that's actually the same. And oh, jeez. Um, but anyway, yes, dry suit certification uh. to not get cold. Sounds like an adventure. Well, you got cold, but not as cold as if it was a wetsuit, like the crazy people in the 60s. <laughs> what you looking at, Haisa? No, I thought I saw something there, no. but after I realized was not it was an interesting geology feature though it was many like almost like globe shaped i guess pillow basalts i suppose so uh, i was going to ask about more of a ridge having more pebbles now than before before it was really pretty much uh coarse sand now we start to mix more but with the other camera we can see yeah. the patch more broken flows yeah it was more consolidated at first but still pretty Angular rocks. They're not. They're not like round. Round rocks. The sponge in the back probably is fairy. And we've pretty much seen like <laughs> holothuriums and the same sponge. <laughs> yeah. So I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing it right, but this is a guillot that we're typing on, as opposed to a seamount. Uh, this one is a seamount. Is this one flat top, Lynette? Uh, good question. I, I <laughs> believe so from the one we mapped can we it earlier, zoom in it was. Oh, what's is it? Oh, is this a regadrilla? We're not in any case getting that high. I um, don't think it is a geo. Oh. It's a big CP gizmo. Oh yeah, could we zoom on the red bit? Ooh. Oh, that's hard to see. Oh. What are you? It is a geo. Polyopagon sponge with unknown red associate. <laughs> if we could get a good picture of it. Yeah, like hold on a second yeah. here. Oh, and a big, That's really a big, big sea chunky sea cucumber next to it. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Jockster. All right, you can zoom as much as you'd like. What is that? Wow. What is, what that? is that all the way in? Yes. It's encrusting almost. Okay, I could try to get closer. No idea what that is. Yeah, let's zoom out. Or rock out the camera, I don't know, whatever. Um, we are falling behind. Okay. Which is unfortunate. I just want to find out what this is. Yeah, I don't know that. If there's, a, if there's a way to get a little closer, sure. Oh, down cam. Sorry, I overreacted there. Hold on, Panos. Oh. There you go. Stay there. Uh -huh. You turn on the downlights. 
zoom as much as you can. Uh, I don't know. Full zoom. You see this? Uh, almost looks like there. something encrusting. It like almost looks like Bryozoan-esque pattern, but it's like pink with those bulges, and I don't know what that is. All right, you need, you need a We can move on if we need to. We're we're not gonna. Okay, as long as you guys got your pictures. Yeah, we got good is pictures. Is there any more okay, zoom at all, or is it? No, that that's full that's zoom. It. That's okay. all good. And I'm right up against the rock. Yep. I can't okay, really yeah, keep it all good. get we any closer. On. Okay, yeah, zoom out, please. I don't know. That's that. That's one of the animals where you go through in your brain. And you're like, okay, tunicate. No, bright <laughs> island. No. <laughs> more. But the is the, the, the pattern. The, so pattern. The, the yeah. arborescent pattern. What is it? What would it be? Um, um, dendritic. Almost. Yeah. yeah. And but that pink. And the sure. bulges in the middle almost makes you be, want to be like mollusk, but it's definitely not mollusk. Well, if anyone in the chat is a uh, diehard follower of deep sea expeditions and you've seen that before, please let us know. <laughs> we do have some um, Nautilus fans here. Somebody said Mike, benthic tenophore. Uh, benthic tenophore. Oh, yeah. that could be Yeah, yeah. That actually, I think, is is probably right. That was one that I didn't run through in my head. Nice work, listener. Yep. Ah, yes. Very, very good, thank you. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> We've collected those before. Um, I've collected, yeah, a sponge with a benthic tinga four on it before. But I didn't see the two, yeah, usually the, the sign there, the what makes you think of it is the two tentacles. But I didn't notice those extending, but it could have just been the angle we were at. Or it's already not yeah, I don't uh, know. complete. Does that thing have the same thing on it? Zoom in, Panos. Oh no, something different. Yeah, crinoid. Is it crinoid? Huge one. Big one. So white. How many Pinkish. arms? Cool. Ten. Is that a sea pen? What's this? Oh. Mm -hmm. um. I just held my breath. <laughs> I think it is. Uh -oh. Zoom in Let's if you can. See. Yes. C pen. C wow. pen. C pen. We are have okay a just seeing. Yeah. We move. C pen. <laughs> yeah, we oh no. We are. Do you want to slow down if there's hope of seeing another one? You want to be moving slower than we are now. Oh. It looks like a pizza sponge. Uh, pardon, was the question? Just if you would like to connect, collect one of these in the future, or this. I would one, like. Yeah. Then we need to act fast. Um, is I it still possible? I think we have time to, to, to yeah. yeah were, were you kidding, James, in. when you said that? Okay. S sorry. Were you or were you joking when you sorry. said we had to move? One. Um, we got a little bit of time. We got a little bit of time. If we think, did we slurp it last time? Yeah, right. I think they slurped it. Okay. I think was the different one. I'm pretty sure. That I'm not sure if this one. Let's see you what's the size of this. Should it be ten centimeters so so. Yeah. I'm only hesitant because we've been going up. Be, uh, and I can't get too far ahead because we're up, up, uh, going up. Yeah, if you want me to move the ship back, I can but do that. Um. It has been so few that we have seen of sea pens that um, I'm, I'm not sure. Can if we if turn we on the down lights, please? Yeah. If it's, if it's too, okay. Puts too, um, Is it a spot where you think you'll be able to, to collect yeah. bridge nav? Three zero meters east, please. All Thank right. you. Some of these species, they burn themselves really, really fast. You're right, they just disappear. They disappear. Um, so I feel like it doesn't look like the sediment is very deep, so... In, in any know. case, a slurp would still be the best option for that, no? Or 
uh, if you catch through the the arm push not in, in the, per the place that you don't break it i need the whole colony it, it will be broken i think if we try and because, grab it because uh, i think they said it is a well there's part that's thing. not coral cutter but the front part is interlocking still okay there is no pro problem if oh do we still oh, it? Annoyed. it is the problem you said no, no, but uh, if we manage to get um, I'm not noticing a difference with that on or off, so... Oh, I, it, to me, that's a habit. I'm sorry. No, no, that's okay. It's not a bad habit. I'm just... Uh, Could we get a zoom quickly before... Yeah, yeah. go ahead, Panos. I would say let's try for a slurp, but if you would like it to try another way, you just let us know. We the fingers on this are not... It's really small. Yeah. I don't think I'm going to be able to get yeah. enough of it down. I think if you want all of it, we're going to have to slurp it. Okay. Thank you. We can try. Maybe give a little bit of work because they, they can burn themselves yeah. quite a lot. It's pretty pebbly, though. I feel like we could we could uh, dig root around uh, enough to get you that out. Maybe you're going to get a little bit of sand as I'd well. I'd say let's go for the slurp while we, we're sitting here. Thank you. I got the photo. Thanks. Uh, thank you. Thank you for... Okay. Uh, zoom out, please. So is that a slurp? Yeah. Yep. We have all slurps free. I'm going on number one. One works. You want to zoom in, uh, James? Uh, can yeah? Can you zoom in, please? Yes. And do you want suction on before you approach it? Yeah, I think that'd be good. Can you turn on the iris, please? On what kind of sea pen is this? So, uh, this is trying to see because like, are you ready? They the stalk. Um, yes. The color resem resemble a lot of protopichilum, but the polyps is so big. Yeah, they are big. But uh, cofibulumnon? Uh, so I think oh of cofibulumnon or calibulumnon. I need to yeah. have a uh, suction. 30. No, not yet. You won't see it. 40 is f as it starts. Maybe even 50 with our hydraulic. There we go. Yeah. I see it. Nice. It's quite small. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh it's retracting. <laughs> if it's retracting. Got some pebbles in there. Wow, it's deep. It's deep. Yeah, that, that's the thing. Oh, well, we got part of it. Oops. Oh no, it retracted all the it way. Retracts. Oh, it, it goes down. Retracted into the sand. Yeah. Yeah. Really? Yeah. This, Maybe we could turn will, off yeah. slurp and then like dig around a little and then try it again. Or what do you think? I think by the way it behaves, I think with the slurp we're not going to work. We are going to get it full with sand instead i think has to to be with the well the sand all goes out no it doesn't this, it doesn't because no because they have, it's, it's we oh, have built it's fine it. mesh and it's coarse sand yeah oh. you all have the fine mesh you may have just filled that up just now okay sediment yeah. sample <laughs> yeah there's your core tube yeah huh. there's could we scoop it so um, is cube can, can be tricky i would try with the the manipulator in the area that doesn't cut, and we can see if we manage to get to pull it out. Okay. Okay. Is that what I was trying to yeah. say before? Yeah. You know, we I didn't think the sediment was that deep. It was deeper than I thought. Yeah, I think we just got a whole bunch. Okay, yeah, can it might we be worth changing out the, the mesh on some of those. Or this, if you this touch it, this sinks more, then you can let it go, you know. Okay. Um, well. Can we turn on the iris on uh, Adelina, please? And by the behavior, I think the, the arms. Is you should turn on the iris. Yeah. 
because yeah, it can't yeah. get in there. Yeah, we could turn it down, so we could try to see his arm. But the polyps indeed is huge. Huge polyps, yeah. What was the idea? I'm sorry about I didn't hear that. Protoptilum. Light seems P R O T O P. That's fine, I guess. T I L U M or I U M. Steve has it in the chat as well. Is P R O? Ah, did you have it right? Yeah. I think this little guy may have eluded us. Yeah. So no, no problem. Yeah. If it's not possible, it's no, no problem. Uh, we have a piece of the, well, I don't think it's the same. Okay, so we can move yeah. on, you think? All right. Um, can I ask a logistical question? Yes. Uh. Why would um, the scoop not be appropriate for something like this? It's just that we are reserving it for nodule-type situations, I although... See here would be kind of a spot where we could like co nodule pebble collect and c pen collect but i also don't i don't know how easy it would be to get the c pen in the scoop usually doesn't work very well yeah um but um we're we not thinking about collecting we can move on to yeah, that what is it works better for spin is the yeah but the one we had is a little bit different design of this one is completely flat so when you grab, grab, you didn't squeeze, like. Yeah. Someone in the chat okay. is asking if We're that's a to get bone in the upper yes. yeah. left. Okay. Bridge nav. About a bone where what? Three zero west, please. Someone in the chat was just asking if that was a bone. Thank you. Um, it was probably a so sponge much. stock. Okay. Rock features here. Yeah. Crinoid on this thing. Haisa, can you tell us more about what happened with that Z pen just there? Was it so you said it retracted? Did, did it bury itself? The uh, Z pens are octocorals, but they are very adapted to soft substrates. So they can, if they're disturbed, some of the species they can retract themselves because they have different polyps that help them to. Um, release the water and contract um, and they manage to burn themselves really really quick um, and by the behavior of this specimen we are trying is one of the characteristics of protopchilin that uh, managed to um, sink themselves burn themselves very quick yeah wow it was interesting Very cool rock formations here. Uh, it is. And a shrimp. Shrimp. Is that one of the euplectelids? Amphidocella is spelled like that. It's, just, it's a little fuzzy. A M P H I D. No, that's okay. I, I turned on the light. C oh. oh, sorry, you already had an yeah. E L L. Back where it was. Oh wow, Th that feature is so. Thank you. Yeah, this is a cool texture. I'm not sure if it's because I see sponges everywhere right now, but it reminds me of a sponge. Mm, another sand patch. So for what it's worth, Steve has chimed in on the science portal to say that uh, the <laughs> protoptilum is quote unquote the fast one, runs away very quickly, um, and may have to just get under another, if, if we come across another one, we may just have to get underneath it with the um, Herc arm, Herc fingers, I guess, as quickly as possible. Yeah. This is true, was like we were, I at first when Touch didn't, it was not that fast, but it's some that's yeah. really disappeared in front right. of her eyes. Yeah, that one kind of waited. Uh, yeah, and then it was like kind bye. of waiting. The polyps were so huge. And, uh, it's more now. for a cofibulominum or a calibulominum than a... Uh, 3-0 west, please. Thank you. 
Someone in the chat wants to know if we got any of the C pin in the jar. Unlikely. I so. It's hard I to say. It doesn't. So. I don't it's think so either. It's really full of sand, so if there is, it's like buried. Now we have a uh, sediment collection in the. Yeah. <laughs> a bonus sample. I tried to. to I guess I could call it a sample. Well, we yeah. couldn't get a push core, so <laughs> yeah, we suctioned um, up some dirt. I did not mark that as a sample. Do you want to? I'm debating that right now. Because um, there is a possibility, like, we got the only got cut off. Maybe it, maybe it didn't retract. Maybe it broke. Well, I'm just we thinking, had the even if the right not around in there, it. if I would like to call the sediment a sample. I think it's in the bucket. I, I think I saw um, it. Yeah. Think you think you saw it? Yeah. That panel saw why it in the jar. We, why don't we call it a sample just in case? And I think there's like there's one scientist ashore who that sediment might be useful for. Usually, with a core, you know, you you know what the top three centimeters are, and people ask for specific sections, which we can't do here. But um, yeah, if we could call it a sample, and if Lynette. Uh, I don't know if you, you could pull up our screen, but we could show you the um, lat long, if that's helpful. Yeah, that'd be great. What is your screen? Um, What's it called? It's capture and thereby failed attempt to sample C pen if you click on that, Jane. Um, yeah, the lat long is there. Okay, I, I can see. read it to you as well if need be. Yeah, I see it. Just a second. I'll write it down. And then, Jane, when you enter that, if you take that timestamp and t put that in the bottom, then it should pull the right data. And I'm sorry, Panos, did you say that you thought I you saw a yes, small I, piece I, of it? I'm like a 90% sure that it went through the hose. Okay, okay. I'll say so possible say capture possible. of partial. Okay, I have those coordinates. Thank you. Perfect. Thank you. You can copy and paste it and yeah, put it into the sample thing. And that's sample number 112? Correct. Thank you. We're up to 112 yeah. samples of screws already? Yeah, we are. Wow. Yeah, we got the 100 last time. And you didn't even see the seven sub-samples on some <laughs> of us. <laughs> <laughs> because every sponge has like two opioids and three polychaetes and lots of snips. And lots of... Um, Squat lobsters. And squat, yeah, squat lobsters, right. Sometimes two squat lobsters on a Chrysogorgia where we were like, oh man, the squat lobsters swam away. It came up and there were like <laughs> two other ones on it, which is very cool. Well, it looks like here the current to be a little bit stronger by the yeah, I see the sediment. Bridge now. Five zero west, please. Thank you. A little too far ahead. Almost that time. Almost. Check Always. out left and right. Oh, these nice rocks. Lots of sand. I hate sand. <laughs> Gets everywhere. You go to the beach and then the beach comes home with you. Some pretty strong sand ripples yeah. here. Did you say the current's picking up? No. 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 Look, no hands. <laughs> no hands. Just yeah. going up because it's slightly buoyant. Mm -hmm. You're slightly buoyant. Definitely evidence of current. Um, just not at the moment. Would you call it a past? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> 
I'm just gonna let that go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna pretend I didn't hear it. Gonna let didn't that pass us right by. Nope, there we go. <laughs> Can we zoom in, Panos? I know it. Someone in the chat says it's time for a whale. Yeah. <laughs> It's time a whale? for a whale, yeah. yeah. I agree. No, yes, right now, and not in not in 15 <laughs> yeah, minutes. Yeah, make sure it happens in the next 15 <laughs> yeah. minutes. Yeah. Oh. oh, man. 17 I, minutes I from now, it'll be a sperm whale chased by an orca, <laughs> right. chased by a shark. Oh, look, <laughs> at that, look at that rectangular Go back rock. over. That's go back a to really right. tabular. Go back to the right. Uh, uh, back to the right. Uh, where are we going? Go, back to, go to the right and look at those rocks at the base of the big boulder we were just at. Down. What There's, like, weird... Elongated rock thing. What is that? Right by the lasers. That's another sponge. That's another dead, dead sponge. Dead sponge? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Okay. No, I mean, if you want, like, I, I don't know. Let's <laughs> zoom in. I'm a physicist, not a I mean, a bryologist. A marine biologist. Did you say a bryologist? Not yeah, a it's, biologist. It's, 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 it's <laughs> early. You're cunning <laughs> linguist, though. another Xenophia 4 behind it. No, Jeez, no, no. Not, none of that. Oh, I got the little. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, 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 and there's oh. more, more of the uh, webby, cobwebby, cobwebby stuff. Okay, stuff. can we come wide, please? <laughs> come wide. It's over here. I would lose it though if, if like we left and then like we go down <gasps> oh, to the lounge. <laughs> oh my goodness! And then we see on the screen zoom in? a whale that they just encountered. Would you run back up here and be like? No, I'd be mad. <laughs> Aristeid shrimp. They kind of remind me of horses. It's different when like you're in here and then you go downstairs and you see it in the, like in the lounge or something, you know? Like the Dumbo octopus the other day. Yeah. Even though I saw it in you, the lounge. <laughs> you weren't here seeing it. I wasn't in here. I want that. Can you zoom out, please? Nice follow. He wasn't holding a cherry or an eight sack, whatever we decided that no, was. No, it was not. That was cool earlier. We've seen some really interesting stuff for a pretty sedimentary area. Don't try to save it. Area. Zoom in. <laughs> what is that? Oh, it's gone. Never mind. I'd say we're about it's 10 gone. on the shrimp count. What was attached to the left side of the rock? I didn't notice this, Akko, but if it was weird and white, we've been seeing a lot of those kind of cobwebby things that we've zoomed on in past dives, but um, don't know what they are. Steve suggested a while ago maybe like sunken larvation houses or something, in. but hard, uh, cup, hard to coral. Say. Mm. cup coral. Cup coral, yeah. Mm. If we could zoom all the way on that. Cue the baby voice. Have they highlighted that yet? Please don't. Come wide, please. Sorry, I had to do it. Is that gold in those rocks? Should we be should we do we be chiseling at those? No, it's a it's a kind of like sedimentary rock underneath. Bridge nav. It's a very scientific description for a couple. Five zero more. west, please. Did he what? A little, 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 little It's like a little extra biggie thingy. It's just like a little, a little. <laughs> Where are the sea pens? I sea know, you know, all this sediment and one the sea, sea pen, but just one. What are, why is that one happy here and no others? <laughs> In really the corner she was, each uh, the sea pen was, you know. We're going to leave, and we're going to see a sea pen the, the size of a whale. 
<laughs> Salute, or a brother. whale the size of a sea pen. Oh, oh that's that actually would that be very would strange. Be <laughs> we would probably <laughs> miss it. <laughs> the whale the size of a well, sea pen. Well, if he's like a Salombalula. Yeah, there'd be like a whale <laughs> swimming by with a sea pen just as big, and like the whale's like smoking a pipe. Like smoking a pipe. There's <laughs> bubbles coming out, you know? <laughs> <laughs> like a bubble pipe. Could Hold it. And it's like. Look at the white thing on like that ease. rock. Yeah. It was like, you zoom in, Pano? Just our luck. Just our luck. <laughs> Asako says highlight with sound, please. <laughs> uh, let's see. Oh, interesting. That's kind no, of cool. that what? Maybe that's Here, what they we were saying. Let's zoom out. Let's get closer. It's kind of uh, crystalline look. It, it is oddly reflective. <laughs> we got a, a message in the chat. The silly watches are the best. You guys are really tired. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. What are you saying? <laughs> Steve's an anemone on that. I don't, I don't, that doesn't look like an anemone, yeah. Steve. Tired. <laughs> Tired. That'll yeah. explain it. I don't know. I, I would have a hard time arguing with Steve. On I, I know. Steve is always right, but I'm just like, that, what? Question mark? I think the aft face really goes with the voice. So nice. That's like a little... This one's fun. It says the word in, in an encyclopedia becomes cup coral. Just a little baby. See? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's the Encyclopedia Britannica. A little, 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 I mean, I would say yes, we can yeah. bunch, it's step closer if you'd like. We've got some yeah, time. Yeah, Steve says closer. Okay. <laughs> what is this? All right, zoom out, please. Yeah. There's calcareous algae that looks like that. But Bridge now. I know that's we're not, not growing down here. Where that would be. Can we hold position, please? Thank you. <laughs> what? <laughs> the bridge. <laughs> uh, guy gets me. <laughs> what do you say? Hold position. <laughs> <laughs> I so it's wish like we could like listen to him. It's back in like a, in the wooden, like a, like the wooden uh, sailing days. You have to like pass the word along. Yeah, right. From one end of the boat to the other. <laughs> you just have like a chain of people yeah. yelling. Laugh to starboard. The literal <laughs> chain of command. Yeah. Did you say left to starboard? I said aft to starboard. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> left to starboard. <laughs> Can you turn the down lights on, please? I would agree. Looks calcareous. But what Looks is precarious? It? As much as you can. Calcareous, it's yeah. Calcareous. All okay. the way I'm in. I'm sorry, I misheard you. I was like, why well, would it be precarious? We should give... We should give uh, we should put a magnifying glass on there. We, we should we like, <laughs> they need that little extra like zoom and be like. Ooh. Yeah, it does, but. <laughs> yeah, with the crowd. Down, yeah, down. it'd be hilarious. We actually like burn like. <laughs> you know the inside of the shelf as well? Is there some fire? Yeah, like yeah. It's, some not, sea, it's not somehow. a shelf. No, not a, yeah, yeah. not we a We have something white right on the left anything. also. Base of detached calcareous colony. Oh, that could be. That could be it. Like it's inverted. It's just so white. So like bright colored. There is a little piece of something in the yeah. sand also I mean, next to it, so that could be a good guess. With the knife. Oh yeah, down. there is something in the sand. Maybe something broken yeah. off. The same, oops, sorry. Could be the same. Uh, That'd be funny. Um, could Steve we try says suction, maybe. Do what? Su suction, we hold the ship, right? Bridge, yeah. now. Uh, yeah, Three zero east, please. I think it's try and section that. It's a lot. Thank cool. you, Steve. I would, yeah, it definitely doesn't look like a monopoque form. It looks too like too thin and not shelly. But Steve's about to be up here. We get to look at it on the jumbotron. Uh, what do you, what are we doing? What's going on? Suction. You want to suction? Yes. Okay. Do you want to do it or do you want to just transfer it over real quick? We could transfer over. Okay. Uh, let me flush, 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 flush. I don't know. 
What are we getting? Are they off? That was a question for the back row, but my mic is muted. The um, do we want line. to, uh, I guess we could just suck it right off the rock? Yeah. I think it's probably going to be hard, brittle, but um, yes, that is, I think, our best bet. That is a lot of dirt. <laughs> and we can do slurp too. The flush is still coarse, right? The flush is empty. But I just mean like like it doesn't have anything. Oh, it has nothing. Okay, Eric. <laughs> Check this out. Hey. Look at what else we got a sediment sample. Yeah, it is weird. Okay. <laughs> Uh, we we're going in two. Is that okay? Two. Yes. All right. Ready? We're at 20. It won't start until 40. It'll start when I tell it to start. <laughs> 40. As soon as you <laughs> tell it 40%. There you go. <laughs> oh, oh, it came whoa. right off. What? <laughs> what just happened? Uh, there it is. There it goes. Oh, there's something goes. There goes the outside of the rock. Let's see what comes through. It might have just been a really cool looking rock. Looks like no, it wasn't a sediment patch. It was too weirdly shaped. Did it just disintegrate? It's, it's still, like suction's still on, but right? Yeah. A big okay, I won't there. drop this then. Hey, one sec. Yeah, that would, be, that would be bad. Question mark, white organism? <laughs> yeah. Well, see, you like, do kind of like Maybe stretch it out a bit. Maybe it in, in some fragment. Just keep the... Uh, thing up. Yeah, see so we're losing pressure when you do that. I'm at 50. Oh, something came through there. Oh yeah, there's some white mm -hmm. stuff in there with the rocks. I think I saw one piece of it. I don't know. Well, we'll hope for the best. There goes pressure. What? Yeah. What's going on with my mouse? Uh, that's the inside of a rock. What is happening here? Alright, I'm about to turn it off. Yeah, turn off the suction, please. Looks like that's all good, then. Thank yeah, I you. I think you're getting pulled by Atalanta right now. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's a I think we can come do down in Delta a little bit. I don't think there's any um, risk of hitting anything here. Uh, you, you're right, you're right. Did you stop suction? Yeah. Come on, bungees, do your job. I'm really bummed that this isn't the lever, you know? Frustrating thing. Yeah, it's been okay though.
Hey. Good morning. Good morning. End of my day. Yeah. There's like a li yeah, it looks like Adeline to stop now. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. Okay. 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 Um, okay. Yeah. Karen, do yeah. you mind if while you're working, I start getting back over to Atalanta? No, no, no. Okay. Do we want to collect a rock here or? Oh. No. Okay. Sorry. Uh, say again. We might want to collect a rock here. Okay. Oh, look at that. The rock is broken open. Does anything look good in the view, or you want to move a little bit? I mean, there's some angular stuff, maybe here, over here. All right. We're going to try and go for that rock. Okay. Good I'm morning. reasonably stable. Thanks. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Is this going to be a forward box or a side box? Side box. We just did a shift change or a watch change, excuse me. Uh, this is Brittany speaking, one of the SCFs on board the Nautilus. And we're going to be with you from 4 to 8 Hawaiian time. I did not. Looks good. Yeah, okay. Uh, about 15 centimeters. I don't have uh, anything. If we can wait for a second. Okay. I mean, you can move, but just like keep the rock in front. Yep. Oh, of course. Uh, yeah, I think I'm going to just do a little shifting around with the vehicle, get a little closer to Atalanta, and then we'll get out of this cloud of dust too. Is that okay? Can anyone hear me? Yeah. yeah. I can okay. hear you, Gabby. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. Is this thing on? Is it? <laughs> <laughs> okay. some troubleshooting um, back here. You want right to hold on there for a second? Yeah, I'm all stopped. Okay. That. So it just seems like we're troubleshooting something back here. Give us one moment. Morning, Lexington, Kentucky. Thanks for joining us. So we are uh, doing a dive. Obviously, we're exploring an unnamed seamount. Um, that seems to be the theme of these cruises. Looking at these unnamed seamounts. This one is um, our maximum depth, uh, 2,706 meters. Can, can we do a rotation on the rock? Yes. Ten to fifteen centimeters. Okay, and that's um, one thirteen. No, it's, sorry, that's one fourteen. One fourteen, one one four. Yep. <laughs> I 
And we can stow whenever in um, one of the smaller compartments in the starboard box. Okay, sounds good. Okay, and a uh, starboard box coming out. Thank you. Except the furthest back. Bronwyn? Yes. Can you tell me the sample ID and depth of the previously collected rock, if that's possible? Uh, and sample salvo? 110, we and the depth we don't usually write down. It's okay, no problem. It's automatic in the metadata. We can find that through C log. We go back through uh, C log so and first. review. Gabby, the chat is saying, I'm reasonably stable as my new model. <laughs> that was quite quotable, I must say. Um, you wanted the size, 10 Thanks, centimeters? <laughs> let's, let's do the sample. Uh, That's great. This sample first, and then we can go back and look at the data after. So make sure we get a good. Yeah, they see me. It's a little hard to see, hey? Yeah. Lots of debris. Um, I will move ahead a little. Okay, thanks. So just like always, for our um, viewers online, if you have any questions or comments about what you are seeing while we are diving live, feel free to send those on over. We have a chat box that is below the live video feed, so if you have any questions or anything, um, send them over. I'll do my best to stay on top of them and make sure that we try to get an answer or at least address the comments or questions that you're seeing. Okay. Nice. That did go in the furthest act. Yes. Starting our watch off with a rock collection. How do you feel about that, Nick? Uh, I'm always happy to collect a rock, uh, especially bright and early in the morning. <laughs> uh, it really gets <laughs> my day going. Yet, but it is early it's not quite yet, but it's not quite, yeah, you're right, dark, yeah, and, early. dark and early. <laughs> so it's like taking a cold plunge for me. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it really wakes me up. Just adrenaline straight to the veins. Yeah, yeah, very <laughs> alert right now. It doesn't take much, does it? <laughs> Just a rock. Okay, back row, we have been heading uh, straight west. Uh, we're kind of on this line between uh, sediment on our right and more rocky stuff on our left. At least we, we were. Looks like we're heading into more sediment now. Um, we can continue. Can you come up a bit? A little I'm bit. I'm going to head pretty oh, yeah. close west uh, to right underneath. Atlanta. And possibly hope for a ridge in that direction, or we can start heading northwest and toward Waypoint. And look down two. when you get the chance as well. Northwest, so northwest keep an is eye a good on idea. We just want to avoid going now. down slope. I okay, just want to sure. keep an eye on how the tether is laying. Okay. Look and look at, uh, all the way down if you can, if the tilt's cooperating. Are you ready for a move to the northwest pilots? Uh, can you stand by just yeah, a little bit? Absolutely. Um, we're going to operate with a wrap in uh, this watch to see if there's a, a an existing wrap in the tether that we're not accounting for. So sure. I just want to get that all set up. OK, that's the camera pointed down completely. What's that? That's the camera pointed down yeah, completely. Yeah, that's perfect. OK, great. Um, okay, this is going to take our wrap out, uh, but uh, come around, uh, follow me around, and I think you're going to want to do... You're turning to... I think you, kind of if uh, Atalanta turns, puts in a positive wrap, that takes out my negative. I think you want to, I think Atalanta should turn uh, clockwise. I believe. Clockwise, back to two eight. 
switch uh, back to... To one starboard. Way? Okay. Let me make sure, okay, no, sorry, that's the wrong way. Okay, go, uh, all right. Go the other way. No worries. Turn counterclock. My bad. No worries. <laughs> 